All righty, guys. Welcome back. Um, today I went to, um, to LGS. I went to, uh, singles hunting, and uh, it's a pretty nice day outside. It's really sunny. <clears throat> it's kind of hard to tell because I use a light now behind my videos, so there's no uh, discrepancies from video to video. But um, it's pretty nice. I got an RX-8. I took the RX-8 out up to town and, and into the neighboring city and hit a few different stores just kind of to shoot the breeze and enjoy the day. And, you know, I get four days off a week, so I like to enjoy my time and drive around and just chit chat all that. So I look for singles that, that are doing a little better on eBay than they are priced in the store. So I like go through a stack, I'll pick out all the cards I like, and then like start looking on eBay and TCG player for, to see where the prices are at in comparison to what the store has them listed. So, um, so first store, um, actually I'll, I got pretty much all the stuff at one store except this Altaria, this Japanese Altaria. I got that at the last store I was at and it was two bucks. So it's an art rare. Uh, I don't know even what set that's from, to be honest, <laughs> but I thought the art was cool and I was like, oh, I'll, I'll take that Altaria if it's cheap. And so yeah, two bucks for that. And then the first store I was at today... I got these. I got the Drapion V from I think Lost Origin, and uh, it's three bucks. I think it's trending on eBay for just a hair over three, uh, around three at least. Some some over three plus shipping. So I think that's a good play. The condition was good. I, I pulled all these out and made sure the condition was near mint. That way I'm not getting screwed. Because if you buy these and the price is the same as what's on eBay, well it needs to be near mint um, before you do that. So. I'll take this guy out and re-sleeve him. Something better. Oh yeah, beautiful. Good, good card. The back's good. I made sure I looked at the back. So, all right. And then we got a Hound Doom. I like Hound Doom. That's second gen. That's Neo Neo Genesis basically. Um, same thing. The price, current market prices are hovering around. Uh, three dollars for this guy. I think I seen even up towards four. So you know the trend is is reversed probably. Um, so pull him out of the sleeve here. Ah, what is this? Oh no. Uh, oh, okay. It was just dirt. <laughs> Damn, I was like, oh, is that a white dot? I didn't even see that in the store, but no, it was just in dirt. Sweet. Another good looking card. Back. Back looks good. Back looks great, actually. This is a really good English card. So, another good deal, I think. And then also, I like, I pick the cards out that have what I like the art, what I would consider good art. I don't. I don't put anything in the pile, even if it's worth more than what I pay for it, if the art isn't there. So this guy, I might have overpaid for him. I, I knew the back was a little bit eh, but gosh, that look at that top left, if it'll focus correctly. That is, mm, didn't catch that. I don't know how I didn't catch that, but I didn't. I had a lot of cards to look at. At least the foil is not too scratched or anything. I'm gonna get a uh, a white. I see a fingerprint on it. I think this is from Obsidian Flames. Yeah, it is. It's Obsidian Flames, English. But I like the art, so I took it. But man, I'm gonna have trouble getting rid of this one one day because of the back. So. Oh well. All right, and then lastly, I'm gonna open some packs here. I got. Um, so the label says $13 on it. I got five of them, but the guy is really chill. His name's Dave. Uh, I said, hey man, would you do me a deal on five? He said, yeah. He said, I said, uh, you know, whatever you think. He said, 10 a piece. I said, sweet. So he must have bought this booster box, I think when the prices were still around 160, which I think that's, I think that's right. He was buying these around 160. So he still is making money at 10 a piece, but Initially wanted 13 and I paid 13 before because it is what it is. The booster box is 220 right now. And so if you were to pay 13 a piece, you're at 260, which is not much money to be made there. But if you bought a booster box at 160, 
to 180. This is a you're making good money at 13 a piece, but I got them for 10 a piece, so 50 bucks, five packs. So it's really not not a big hit um, to my wallet versus buying a booster box. So shuffle these up. It's gonna uh, let's open them. I really think Japanese 151 is just absolute gold, guys, if you don't know. Okay, is it one, two, is it three? Oh, no. Oh, I ruined it. <laughs> it's just two in Japanese. Okay. All right. Um, Victory Bell, that's what it is. Victory Bell. Grabber. Zubat. Castly. Look at Tom. Caterpie reverse, and I think you already saw it. I'm looking for the. Okay, I mean, we already saw the card behind it. Uh, it's the Mew. <laughs> but hey, got a Mew. Even the Pokeball reverses, man, that stuff's just, it's gold. Y'all can argue with me, but. I don't see how any other set is going to do, except for like Fusion Strike and this Sword Shield, Scarlet Violet. I don't see any other set doing better than um, Fusion Strike and 151 Japanese. Okay, so it's one, two. Rapid Dash. Tone Fossil. Do Duo. All right, we got a Victory Bell. Oh, it's got the stacked, it's got the stacked Pokeballs. Sweet. Sweet. That's what I want. And yes, I have this, but yes, I love the Japanese Zapdos. Art, uh, uh, full art, yes. Nice. Nice. That's a good one. That's a, uh, one of the better ones, in my opinion. Nice. Too bad I already have it, but you know what? I like it. All right, hold on my camera here. It's telling me a little battery. I don't charge my phone enough. All right, here we go. One, two. All right. Got a slow bro. I have a sword. Some chop. Seal. Weedle. Tangela. Oh, it's got the stack Pokeball. Nice. See, it's not it's not too rare, but this is the most I've gotten so far out of, out of Japanese. This whole booster box must be filled with them. So, all right, and a wheezing. Boo. I should have saved my Japanese rares. I'm, I'm kind of regretting getting rid of my regular hollows, but whatever. What Eva? What Eva? How do Australians say it? How do British people? What? What? What Eva? <laughs> they say things weird. Two, all right. The Fable, Arcanine, Bulbasaur, Tentacool, Ponita. Oh, nice Caterpie. Uh, alternate art illustration or illustration rare. That's that's what it is. God, I'm not with it today, guys. I don't know if I'm tired or what, but. Sweet. I did the pack trick wrong? No, I didn't. So I don't get a reverse Pokeball, but I get the Caterpie. Excellent. Two two in a row. Actually, three. It's worth three for three because that Mew's not bad either. All right, guys. This can't be last pack. I had five packs. Uh-oh. One, two, three. Okay, this is. All right, last pack. Come on, Charizard. Big three. All right, Scyther. Hit on Lee. Vulpix. Tangela. Weeping Bell. All right, Poliwhirl. 
Don't have the stacked Pokeball, but hey, can't be every card, right? All right, last card. Here we go. Last pack, last card. Ah, nine tails, EX. All right. Hey, I'll take it though. Better than a rare. So, all right, guys. So, for five packs, I mean, those are the hits. So, not bad. All right, well, thanks for watching, guys. Tomorrow, I got a heavy hitters box next to me. I bought from Sam Club. And uh, I'm going to break it open and go through it. But uh, until then, peace out. Thanks for watching. Enjoy the weather out there. Be careful.